sun don't shine when you're not near I don't feel like I do when you're with me I felt like such Checking into our hotel Souls collided, hearts entwined When I decided to make you mine Oh my gosh This room is unfair That I'm speaking of This is love if I'm making you breakfast This is love if I feel myself coming down Now that's luxury We are getting ready to go to Boat Key and Clark Key Which is a bunch of restaurants and nice area to walk around Yes, Ryan? And bars. I've already started. We're doing the Tiger Lager beer, which is very singy. We're going to be skipping the Grab today, which, by the way, Grab is their Lyft slash Uber here, and skip the Grab today because Formula One is just crazy. They're closing off streets, and it's like impossible to get around. So we're going to be taking the MRT train, and so I think that's also going to be an experience. All right, you guys. I will update you later. Can you guys hear that? This is Boat Key and Clark. It's giving Clark Kent. It's so beautiful. All these restaurants. Woohoo! Gay Pride! Today is the day of the race for the F1 and our hotel is full of people just from all over the world. Like we're talking, there's even like the secret service for a president because it's so huge. And the racer that I'm going for, Checo Perez, is qualified in second place last night. So I am just hoping he wins today. He like lost by like 0 0.022 seconds. So my hope is Mexico wins today. There's been an update. I don't think I'm gonna be able to dice in my bangs because the connector for the plug doesn't work because it has a motor. So, what am I gonna do? Just gel them? Pull out your dice and if you plug it into the wrong pinball. Okay, well that plan's canceled. I'm just gonna have to gel the bangs. Or just let them live their life because we're not gonna risk it. That is not a biscuit I'm risking. Jacket? I need a jacket. No. Forget it. We are out of here. We're about to leave for the races. Ah! A jacket? Nah, nah, nah. It's too hot. I'm cold. Hey, guys. Hi.
Good morning, you guys. It's the morning after the 2022 Formula One races here in Singapore, where Checo Perez, representing Mexico, won. Ah! Honestly, I cannot believe my voice has not gone out because of all the screaming. What an experience from beginning to end. Love the community of it all. Um, and just seeing people, like different types of people coming together just to celebrate and have fun. As you're walking through the gates, you see people wearing like their flag. And so then I saw some people like on their back, they had like the Mexican flag and they'd be like, whoa. And I had my racer, which also was representing Mexico. So they'd see me and be like, yeah, woohoo, Mexico, Mexico. Hey you guys, so I'm in the bathroom right now getting ready, brushing my teeth, washing my face. I'm gonna do a quick body wash and everything. Ryan and I are gonna go to get some massages, so obviously wanna be fresh and ready so I can just relax and I'm so excited. I haven't gotten a massage in like, never. I think I've only gotten like one massage in like my whole life and that was like years ago. So I'm really excited to get a massage here in Singapore. So I just washed my face, put on some sunblock. I think I'm gonna go bare face to the spa. Um, and I'm trying to figure out if I'm going to change or not. I feel like that also is unnecessary because I'm just gonna show up and put on a robe and be naked. So, but I also feel like, what if I show up to the spa and feel like underdressed because what if like the entire cast of like Crazy Rich Asians is there and like they look so fancy and nice and I just... I'm gonna rest the camera on the bench that they have. We just got out of the massage and I feel so relaxed, but we just walked into the daily rain that is Singapore. So I think we're gonna have to run. We have to get where? Okay, all right, let's do it. And I wore chanclas, oh my gosh. <laughs> just throw it in the bag, oh, oh, oh. Look at this, salted egg as a snack. Hmm, perhaps. Ryan used to grow up on these. <sighs> Seriously, this looks like the equivalent of a four logo. It's 9%. Strong zero, but they got a sweet little peach on it, so it's like harmless. <laughs> Should we get it? Get this one, it has yuzu. Oh my god. 
to that. And that is, that's the one that I tried. That's the childhood one, teriyaki beef burger? Is that, what is that? <laughs> oh, they slopping it on there. Yeah, look at that tomato. Yes, you, baby. It's special because Ryan grew up on these. This is a Singaporean twist, but it is still Moss Burger. That teriyaki burger. So good. The lettuce is so crunchy and the bread is so soft and yummy. There's teriyaki sauce on it. it makes it a little different and special. Okay, you guys, I just finished my bath and threw on some eye gels from Patchology. I'm just gonna sit here and just relish in this beautiful hotel room because tonight's last night here at this hotel and we're gonna be going to Sentosa Island this weekend to do a little bit of early birthday celebration. Have some takeout on its way, so later. It totally looks like you You're just classy, I ain't trying to keep it concealed. Oh mama, I want it, just let it fall off. If you tell me that you want it, baby, it's a gun deal. Oh mama, New hotel I want it, it I want it, oh. Like you gotta wait for it, honey. I know I we are quickly changing because we are gonna go explore the island and do some bougie. And if the bungee jumping is not close, I'm gonna commit trying to do it. Okay, bye. Wherever we are. Fun fact about me, she's an adrenaline junkie. So I'm looking for that today. And I might get it because we're running in the sidewalk like this, so. Please, God, let this be it. I'll update you if we make it. Mm. No. <gasps> They're shutting off the lights. We were still looking for the godforsaken luge. Oh. <laughs> Look at We're all over this Singaporean park that is Sentosa Island. They still have the cable car running. Oh I think we're getting closer though. Look, look how cool that is. I hope at the end of this road it is the bougie. We hiked pretty far up a hill to find it. So pray. Diosito por favor. We did it you guys. Oh my gosh, we made it. Let's do this. They turned us away because it's sold out. We made it to the it's sold out. Ryan tried to slip them some money and they still said no. They're sold out as hell. Well, thank you for the hike. OMG, it's my first toilet in the ground. <laughs> Here it is folks, here we go. There has been a quick change of events. We are now going to Resorts World, which is like right outside of Universal Studios and seeing if there's some tickets available for Horror Nights. I don't know why I signed up for this. It may be the two tequila shots that we took on our way out, but she's feeling that Horror Nights. I can't believe you convinced me into this, Ryan. I'm gonna throw up, I'm gonna vomit, I'm gonna die. One thing about me is that I'm a scary bitch and when I see something scary, I throw up. All right, let's go. Hold my hand, I'm so scared. I don't even do horror nights in Los Angeles. You think horror nights in Singapore is not gonna be scary? These bitches made like the ring. Oh, that's delicious. That was delicious. I didn't even 
taste the alcohol. All right, let's go. Brian is giving me a spotlight so I can update you guys. Mommy is up next, but before we do, we're stopping for a little snack. We stopped for a Korean corn dog, and I just wanted to show you guys the cheese bowl. <laughs> no cheese bowl. Cheese bowl wasn't there. This corn dog's really good. Mini cheese bowl. They're having the best time at Fright Night. And you want to know why? Because I haven't been scared shitless by anything. I've just been riding roller coasters. The little merch. Spooky! Just had to quickly update you because I thought that the Jurassic Park ride was open, but it wasn't. And I just subjected myself to a Hollywood horror maze. And it was so scary. Help me, Mom. Mom, can you come pick me up? I'm scared. We are about to enter far, far away. All of my Shrek dreams are coming true right now. Is that the fairy godmother? I cannot believe I am here. All right, you guys, take two. We tried to go to the Singapore Luge and Skyline zip line sold out like they were sold out and we made a hasty decision of Ryan like went to me and was like do you want to just like go to Universal Hollywood Horror Nights and we're never not down like so amazing it was one of those unexpected but amazing nights you know and it's always those that are just like on a whim that it's just like the best and I had the most amazing time I feel so spoiled today we are as you can see Ryan is over there booking the tickets now so when we arrive we for sure have a spot and we are gonna do the luge the zip line and just see what else we can find in that little area hopefully we can find a beach and walk along and just get some food and just have a nice last day here in Sentosa Island Little town, it's a quiet village across the street from the 7 Eleven.
happening, y'all. Chicken rice here at the Maxwell Hawker Center. Without the sauce first. Oh wow. Now I gotta try the sauce. That is spicy. Try the bok choy. Avocado bro. I did get the avocado bro. Who would have thought it could be sweet? Mmm. Well that's good. All right, you guys, coming to you live from the bed. If you can hear me, uh-huh, yup. Her voice is shot. Um, all this traveling and moving around and exploring has caught up to her, and so she's chilling in the bed and just relaxing because tomorrow we have our flight to Tokyo. And I think we leave at like 3 a.m. here. And then we fly for six hours to Tokyo and then we have a layover for five hours. And I just have to run around and see as much as I can of Tokyo airport. Um, and then from there, we're gonna be flying to Hawaii to see the family. So she will be spending her last day in bed. Um, just resting, packing up some stuff. If you're the person that made this kimchi soup, 